Welcome on my YouTube channel. So, dear friends, I have found today afternoon anywhere backside in front of my listening room this old and pretty heavy public address amplifier in term PA9336. 21 kilograms weight, so it's about 44, 43, 45 pounds. And uh, <coughs> I had to open it <laughs> because if I see from backside, this terminal <coughs> is uh, uh, the plastic inside is damaged. There are two screws and uh, it's broken, so somebody pressed it <laughs> from this direction, and the uh, plastic parts near the screws are broken. So I dismount all the screws, and inside it's totally dirty but uh, it doesn't matter it's okay because if it is a lot of da huge dust inside it means that nobody tries tried to repair it so it's original but it looks pretty 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 nice do you see it <laughs> the dust and if i put it so i would like to show you the connector uh, the terminals here are the two screws and the plastic from this side and from this side is broken and it's necessary to fix it here in this original position but i'm not sure if i if i will do it but uh, it, if i will connect the wires it's necessary to secure that it will not touch the chassis because here is also the 100 volts so Pretty, pretty heavy piece of technique <laughs> produced since the year 2003 up to 2011, if I say it correctly. And when I, when I was searching info on internet, <laughs> I didn't believe my eyes uh, regarding the prices because the huge, 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 uh, huge sum of money uh, it's a mono amplifier 360 watts 360 so i believe this uh, this number because it's incredible incredible heavy so i <coughs> will try it uh, but at first i have to clean it the dust with vacuum cleaner and brush i will clean the dust and then i will connect uh, correct <coughs> one of my professional Dynacord boxes and uh, we'll see what happens. So <clears throat> now is evening and uh, I will not do it now, I will do it tomorrow. But uh, this intro I'm recording, recording today, today evening. So we'll see what happens. I will go on and thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing my YouTube channel and if you like my videos you can also join my channel and now <coughs> it's time, it's evening here in Prague so it's time to relax and I will go on, go on tomorrow but you, you it's not necessary to wait. The video will go on immediately. So, dear friends, it works! Uh, as I told before, uh, maybe, because <coughs> I have recorded the first part of this video uh, yesterday evening and now we have the next day evening and I decided to go on with this video. There was a lot of dust in it, as you could see uh, before, then uh, was uh, or is broken the back terminal, the two screws uh, or two, the part of the plastic of the 
terminal for two screws is broken so I uh, decided uh, to because I don't like to touch the wires the uh, ground or together to damage it uh, I uh, took a piece of plastic and with this piece of plastic uh, I fixed uh, the back terminal to the back panel and it holds no no problem then I have connected uh, signal from CD pair through this mixer as you know my Numark mixer <coughs> in the link input and here I have used the COM uh, wire and the, the second one is uh, 4 ohms uh, so it works uh, when i switch it for, for the uh, first time at first is the red light protection then the green and then uh, <coughs> all lights off and it works so let's switch it off and i hear the fan so fan is working immediately after switching on uh, the light by this switch main power the red light is on switch off Switch on, red, green, green, and <coughs> the signal goes to the uh, to the mixer. So the track number three. This is the motorbike from YouTube library only, as you can see. <laughs> I must say I'm glad because it's the, for the first time when I switch it on and uh, it it works so I think that it was not a bad deal when I have bought it about <laughs> about I could uh, would like to say 20 years ago but maybe maybe because uh, because it uh, the production started regarding the info on internet around the year uh, 2003 so <clears throat> it can be about 20 years old and as you can see or could see uh, here is uh, some scratch on the front panel so <coughs> this uh, amplifier is for sale if is anybody interested uh, interesting is also this uh, connector because this is dc input 24 volts so it can be used anywhere in the truck or, or as you as you want so i must say I like such a heavy amplifiers. So uh, this device is for sale. You can find it later on my website Anglic Audio CZ on the page Professional Amplifiers and uh, <laughs> under my internal number and the internal number you can read uh, in the video description I don't have my book here where I write all, all the numbers so thank you for watching thank you for subscribing to my youtube channel and as I always say if you like my videos you can also join my channel so have a nice day Thank you.